Confia, confia em suas quedas, uhum. suas quedas são bom. Confia, você tá, suas quedas são muito bom. When you and like we were saying, when your body gets tired, that's when your mind says this is where winners are made. When your mind gets tired, that's when your heart says this is where champions are made. And when your heart gets tired, this is where your your warrior spirit says, I'm gonna be a legend in this sport. I'm the eraser. And that's what it's about, being a champion, it's championship rounds. So uh, related, it's one of the greatest moments uh, in sports, it's the uh, greatest moments in my life. We did it, we did it. You have reached that new level in my opinion, it's cool to see you getting the respect that you deserve. Um, I know that it's been a long time coming. You guys met Captain Eric Alberts, that's my mentor. Captain Eric affect you as a role model growing up? Oh, I mean, Eric, Eric's been actually one of my biggest supporters uh, in wrestling and in life in general. Let's put it to you this way, but my brother joined the Army because uh, of Eric. He's been someone that we can always go, you know, go up to and really get great advice, and he's been there for us, you know, and I think every kid should find somebody, if it's a mother, a father, someone to look up to and really ask for advice, and he's, he, he's, been, our, he's been our guidance to, uh, to victory. I think uh, Eric's been a great example in our life, you know, with, with him being a captain in the Army, uh, a great wrestler, national champion, and not only that, but getting his actual degree. I mean, the guy's uh, he's the jack of all trades. <laughs> My team, Captain Coach, Captain America. So I made it my goal to not only just bend reality, to create reality. I'm not in the business of MMA, I'm in the business of possibilities. You say it's impossible, I say we can do it. You say we can't get a, uh, I, I can't get a belt in every weight class, well that's my goal. He just became the greatest pound for pound fighter of all time, the only Olympic champion to win the flyweight title and beat the greatest of all time, beat TJ Dillashaw, and now he beat the most dangerous man in weight to win the 135 pound and get that triple champ status. Olympic champ and champ champ in the UFC. It's unheard of, it's triple C. It hasn't been done before and it'll never be done again. World best striking coach, and world best wrestling coach, Captain Eddie Bosman. Great coach, Eddie Chow here, he put the game plan together. Obviously, Captain, Captain Eric Alvarez, who's always been by my side. I was giving him attention, Joe, you know. One of the most char colorful characters in the game. Coach, 
the year, Captain Eric Alvarez. Thank you, brother. What's the best advice he's given you so far in your career? Um dos melhores conselhos que ele me deu foi o que eu uso até hoje, que é acreditar nas minhas quedas no meu wrestling. Ele fala que eu sou faixa preta em wrestling. Se o wrestling tivesse uma faixa, eu seria preta. Então, aprendi muito com esse cara. E é isso. Acho que o que falta no Brasil é essa modalidade. E ele tem completado essa, esse Defeito entre as que nós temos lá no nosso país. But he said that uh, he's always talked about how, how important wrestling is for MMA, and that's something that Brazil has a weakness in. So the fact that he's bringing that as a strength, it, and he's always told me that to believe in your takedowns, that you're a black belt in wrestling. If the wrestling had a black belt, you'd be my black belt. He could beat any All American out there, and he has done it before. It's got Beck Rawlings on it. You just cross that off. We've got Master Valerie Troubler Turno next. And then you say you after that you want the champion in Alima Lay McFarland. Uh, yes, he was sleeping, so I did my job. I'm sorry. But I don't give a f I am the champ champ now. F you Two UFC belts, soon to be three, when Triple C becomes C4 when he makes Volkanovski bend the knee. Patricio Pitbull, the Bellator go with two belts, and Patricky Pitbull, the king of KOs. Leandro Alter Ego, the Pitbull brothers that will soon be dismantling Conor McGregor's team, SBG, one by one, until McGregor comes to save him. The Korean Zombie, the UFC number one featherweight. Welcome to the zombie apocalypse of 2020. And finally, Paulo the Eraser Costa, who will erase the style bender in the biggest UFC middleweight fight in history. Three.